mate, and welcome to Grey Wolf Fitness. Now you've said the title, aren't you? So it's putting up what's the title, so... I don't know, love, what's the title? I said don't laugh. <laughs> <laughs> the title is Gods of Grip, Thomas Inch, Loadable Dumbbell. Nice. Wow. <laughs> now that's a mouthful, isn't it? It is, soon? yeah, I don't know I'm going to get that in the description, but hey how. Right, so, everybody out there, you've heard of the Tom Hitchens Dumbbell, haven't you? So, these are your Tom and inch dumbbells. They're a thick handle, they're of, um, a traditional lift in the grip. Yeah. However, how expensive are they, Tom? Far too expensive. So you're looking, at just this set up here, I would say more than a thousand pound? Easily, yeah. They're probably about 320 quid. For yeah. The 78 kilo. Yeah. So, to. I would say, try and practice for the Thomas Hitch dumbbell. You are going to come across something like this a standard two inch loadable dumbbell. Now, that's okay, but with the Thomas Hitch dumbbell, the actual theory behind it, it pulls out your hand. Yeah. So, Tom has come up with a loadable dumbbell. So, the middle is offset. So when you try and lift it, it spins out your hand. Is that correct? Exactly, yeah. So the loadable dumbbell is going to be how much? 60 pounds. Yeah, 60 pounds. Yeah. So it was the, it's the one way of, of training for the Thomas Inch. Yeah. And if you're up and you've tried the Thomas Inch before and you're thinking, oh, I'm never going to be able to train up to that, this is going to be a game changer for you. Massively, yeah. I think... The cost effectiveness, effectiveness of this, and it's actually going to be a lot harder to lift this than the actual inch. So if you're lifting a decent weight on this, you're going to lift the inch with ease, really. So, so let so talk us through what, what's the uh, the dynamics behind it. So we've made the handle the exact same size as the inch dumbbell. One of the hardest parts of the inch is obviously the thickness of the handle, which is two and three eighth inches wide. It's also quite short, so people with big, thick hands really struggle to get a good grasp on it because they basically can't get the whole hand down. Again, which is another dynamic of why the inch is so hard to lift. So this is the same dimensions as that to make it, just so you get more comfortable with the actual inch. Um, and the offset part, so if I try and lift the inch dumbbell here, it's rolling out my hands which is the hard part of it, whereas if you try and lift that, that is, is there's no rotation at all, which... And this is the same weight as that, yeah. and so, so, just so, so having the, 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 the handle yeah. at the bottom... It's going to be pretty similar. <laughs> you just turn it slightly yeah. to the side. Yeah. So if we turn it slightly angled here, it's, you know, <laughs> I'm really going to struggle. It's trying to peel out my hands like that. Yeah, it's... So, so you can have it, have it at different different handles to train. Yeah. But having it that way, I don't know whether I'll be able to do this. <laughs> yeah. But you can feel it trying to spin out your hand yeah. like a Thomas Inch. It's extremely difficult. The lower you go, the more it's going to be on your upper forearm. And the higher you go, the more it's going to be sort of on your wrist. So the Gods of Grip are now taking pre-orders. Yeah. I will leave, um, or Suzanne will leave um, description and... A link. A link <laughs> to Gods of Grip. That's the word you were looking for, yeah. That was the word I was looking for. <laughs> so don't forget to like, subscribe, share. What else, babe? Leave a comment. And get that Thomas Inch dumbbell.